pretty bad in Rome Mountain. I'm not going to sugarcoat it for you. And that's also bad over in Johnson County. That's where we find Leah Johnson. We go to her live now. Yes, I am here on Lumpkin Branch Road where it is awful. It is coming down like crazy. I can barely even hear anything. My umbrella is going everywhere. If you look behind me, this is the road that I was on not even two hours ago. Believe it or not, but that is a road. That is a road. That was that was a road not even two hours ago. It is completely flooded. The bridge is completely flooded. We've already seen some people attempting to make this drive, which is just it's not a good idea. It is not a good idea. Everybody needs to stay home because it is awful out here. We have seen uh, broken down branches coming down, flooding through this road over here. You can't even see the road. This is where this is what's going on here in Mountain City. We have a shelter open in downtown Mountain City at First Christian Church for people. There are a lot of people over down this road that live over by Roan Creek right here and they are getting flooded out and hopefully seeking shelter out here because the wind is picking up like crazy in terms of the flooding. This road is completely blocked off. If you're coming in from that side over there, it is completely blocked off all the way down Lumpkin Branch Road in Mountain City. There is no road. There is no road at all. So everybody should be home and be careful and stay safe. Back to you guys in the studio. Yeah, certainly some wow. some good words there. Stay yes. safe. And of course, Leah and Kelly, Kelly taking shelter inside. Right. We're seeing those conditions now firsthand. Roads being washed away. Absolutely, absolutely. Take that, heed that advice. Stay home. Don't be out unless you absolutely have to. With, thanks to Kelly and Leah and all of our uh, crews that are out there today and to our storm team for keeping us apprised. And we'll be back with more daytime Tri Cities coming up in just a few moments as we continue our coverage of the remnants of Hurricane Helene going across our area right now. <laughs>